we flipped the presidency. We know that we can flip the Senate, and now we're going to change the, his the history of the country. From the beginning. All eyes are now squarely focused on the state of Georgia and its two Senate runoffs set for January 5th. If Leffler and Purdue lose in Georgia, we're screwed. We all know what's going to happen if McConnell holds the Senate. It will be obstructionism as far as the eye can see at a moment of crisis when we need strong action. I mean, so many families here in Georgia and across the country can't feed themselves right now. All of us are impacted by environmental hazard, but we see over and again how these issues disproportionately impact communities of color. This Senate race is not just about who has 50 votes and who controls the Senate. This is what's on the ballot. We need to be clear. What's on the ballot is the George Floyd Act and whether or not we can get action about police violence. That's what's on the ballot. What's on the ballot is the John Lewis Voting Rights Act and whether or not our voting rights are going to be protected. What's on the ballot right now is COVID relief. Republicans have controlled this chamber for four years, and yet not a single Republican bill that addresses climate change. Climate is now a top three issue for voters across the country, and it's about time that our Congress and our administration starts acting beginning. like it. Y'all make history here, and we'll continue to make history here.